friends, welcome back to my channel. But if you're new here, my name is Lizzie. I'm a Disney Plus collector from the UK, and me and my fiance Joe are in Walt Disney World for two weeks. So today is day 11. We are heading to Magic Kingdom today. It is our second to last day at Magic Kingdom. So today is a party day, but we go because it's really, really quiet in the morning. Either people have a lay in because they're going to be at the parks an hour later or people don't have park up on their passes so they go to another park but Magic Kingdom is genuinely really quiet on the morning of these days like we did Peter Pan yesterday because it went to 20 minutes and it hasn't been 20 minutes at all the entire time we've been here apart from party days so originally we tried to avoid party days but we've been going in on party days now and then Park copying the out when it gets busy. So I'm just going to go in the shower and we're going to have breakfast. It's a half seven now open again, so we need to get ready quickly. Plan this morning, we are heading into Tomorrowland. So basically, I only really hit one thing. We both dropped a buzz because Seven Dwarves is down and everyone's heading to Space Mountain, which is where we were originally heading anyway. I think the People Move is also down, so I'm not sure where we're going to go next. But hopefully Seven Dwarves is back up soon because it'll take a load of people off the other rides. They're running. No one's stopping them. Thank <laughs> you. 
I've had to tie my hair up because the humidity is on my hair really, really frizzy. And uh, I want to take some photos in this outfit today, so it just wasn't happening if my hair stayed like that. We've just done Pirates, also done the Jungle Cruise, Big Thunder Mountain, and Bus, so we're doing alright today. We all feel really unwell now. Joe's spun us too much. So if you see my breakfast, it's Joe's fault. Interrupting the vlog to give you some news, my dad has managed to secure the tennis hook bag. So I've got the pop and the popcorn bucket and it looks like a poster from the picture. And he also got himself a hot dog, probably so that I'd let him buy the stuff. So I'm really, really happy. I texted him back and thanked him and I said, could you also try and get the Halloween squishmallows from McDonald's? Because they'll probably all be sold there by the time I get home. So he's going to McDonald's next. Where are we now? Where are we? <laughs> Where are we? And the storm. Where are we? Did I just choose to press it? And what did I think was going to happen?
hold up before a trap, so we're going to go and do that now. Didn't bring my GoPro with me because you've seen it before, and it's a bit of that sort to keep it on. So I'm going to go and enjoy it without having to film it. So I would never wait 50 minutes for a ride if I knew it was 50 minutes, but that's where they're getting at. Are we going to head out to the hotel now? Yeah, we're going to go and eat our All Star Music, and then I think we're heading to Epcot because I'm going to eat to the beach tonight. So it's three o'clock and we're gonna go and eat in the hotel and then head to Epcot. I've done a little bit of packing because I don't want it to just be one mad rush Sunday night and I think it's all going okay. I shouldn't get too stressed Sunday night or Monday morning. But yeah, we're gonna head into Epcot after we've had a pizza between the two of us and filled pack cups. You look mental. And why are you swinging so much? Because I'm holding so many cups. <laughs> what a shame, you bought this on yourself. You got it... three cups, Joe, over here. And welcome to the stage, Hoover State. And the funniest thing happened before we went in. Someone asked the cast member what it was like and he said it's just a train ride and as she was walking away he said with one flip and we thought he was just winding her up but Joe worked out halfway through that he means the bit when Figment has his open house and everything's upside down and we just thought that was so clever. Joe wanted to go and tell him how good it was because the girl probably won't have got it to be honest but I thought that was really funny. It's quarter to nine and we are heading back to All Star Music now. 
Oh, thanks. <laughs> So it's just coming up to half nine and we are back from Epcot, a very busy Epcot. We don't tend to go to Epcot on an evening or a weekend, but I wanted to see Hoobastan because I'm really glad I did. Jo, what was your highlight today? I've uh, forgotten what we have done. You asked me that, but my mind was blank. Uh, Magic Kingdom yeah. Epcot. Um, Drinking water at a Sammy. <laughs> mm. <laughs> a bit pasty. Yeah. The pizza. I don't even know what we've done today. Try. Mm, that's not try. Um, small bowl. Probably big thunder. Big thunder. Okay. Um, my highlight is probably Hoover Stank, but also from a personal perspective that has nothing to do with the holiday. I've been invited to a PR event that I could confirm attendance for today and I'm really excited to share it with you. I'm actually going to leave a card above to the vlog because if I've scheduled this right in my brain, that vlog should have gone up before this one goes up. So you'll have already seen it but just in case you haven't, it's up there. It took a little bit of moving trains and all sorts and getting time off work but it's all going ahead and I'm really really excited. So that is it from us today. I think I'm going to go straight to sleep. We are in Epcot tomorrow, so I think it's a more normal get up. I think I'll get an extra half an hour in bed, which I'm very excited for, as my feet really hurt and I keep waking up with headaches because I'm not sleeping enough. But if you enjoyed this video, please like, comment and subscribe. And join me next week for tomorrow's vlog, which is day 12. We are spending the day in Epcot and then probably park hopping to Magic Kingdom for the evening. Thanks for watching. Bye!